They're more than regrettable, they're outrageous. Foreign Minister Ellington has been the Foreign Minister of Belize since 2008. I remind you that is almost going on 10 years. He knows better than this and if he does not, then he has no business being the Foreign Minister of Belize. I've never been as definitive about his role and his actions and his words as I am on this occasion. I think he has passed the mark. It's a convention that former foreign ministers try not to criticize the sitting incumbent. In this case, I can't follow that protocol and with good reason. It is words that put us at a distinct and severe disadvantage if we have to explain to the international community that either we agree with what Sede Ellington is saying and we don't have internationally recognized borders, or worse, that we reject the words of our own top diplomat. I can't see any foreign minister allowing those words to stand. And I think more than owing Belizeans a duty to explain himself, he really has to walk that back. And if he cannot or he will not, then the Prime Minister has a duty to reject those words.